welcome to part two of my guide to the dragons on House of the Dragon. In the previous video, I spoke about the dragons that are on Team Black and Team Green. And now I'm going to talk about the unclaimed riderless dragons that might come into play. I'm just going to mention the dragons that have been mentioned or hinted at. There are more wild dragons that we haven't seen or some that haven't even hatched. Number one is Vermithar or the Bronze Fury. This is an important dragon. This is the second biggest dragon after Vagar, and it's sitting in Dragonstone unclaimed. We saw this dragon in season one where Damon was trying to woo it and sing to it, and it's still there as far as we know. His last rider was actually King Jaehaerys, Viserys' grandfather, and the king we saw in the beginning of season one. With him in the Dragon Mount in Dragonstone, we have Silverwing. This is the dragon that was ridden by Jaehaerys' wife and the queen, riderless and roaming around free and unclaimed. We also have Sea Smoke, Laenor's dragon, Rhaenyra's ex-husband, who left and now remains riderless and is roaming around between Driftmark and Dragonstone, feeling quite lonely. At the end of season one, Damon does a recap and he mentions three wild dragons roaming on Dragonstone that I assume to be one, Sheep Stealer, a dragon that eats sheep, two is Cannibal, a black dragon that eats other dragons, and the shy and timid dragon, Grey Ghost. There are definitely more dragons that aren't mentioned, that will come in later, that will hatch later. But these are the ones that have been seen or directly referenced. I hope to see them in action and I hope you guys found this guide helpful. Bye-bye.